Uh, aspirin resistance can be measured with platelet function studies. Um, there are some platelet function studies which are the traditional uh, studies which take quite a long time to get back, quite expensive, quite um, 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 resource intensive, but there are now new devices on the market which can actually measure platelet function uh, very, very quickly. One of the things we are interested in is a, is a point of care approach where you'll take a patient who's gotten aspirin, clopidogrel, whatever they or, or not, uh, to measure their platelet function you know, at the point of care. Uh, the test can be done very quickly and then can make a decision about what to do about it. Uh, what to do about it is something we are also currently studying. Uh, the, the, our, the idea is that if someone is resistant to aspirin, and that can be measured again in one of these point of care tests. If they are resistant to aspirin, then they should get some other antiplatelet therapy, be it clopidogrel, be it a 2B3A receptor blocker, or whatever it turns out to be.